Erica J here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Please like, comment, and subscribe below. As you see by the title, I'm going to be doing a review on the Maybelline 24 Hour Skin Tint um, Super Stay. We'll see how it goes. I don't really wear makeup all that often, so you know, we'll see if it works. But so far, I mean, it looks good to me. All right, let's get into it. All right, y'all. I'm gonna use my little mirror because I can't see y'all. <laughs> So, um, yeah, let's get started. Um, how cute is this mirror, y'all? I got it for Christmas. Um, I got a little light in there. So, oh, there she is. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna use this. And uh, yeah, gonna get started. Do you have to put primer on with skin tint? Guess we'll find out. Y'all can let me know. I'm gonna use primer. Mm -hmm. I know y'all probably asked me why do I already have my lashes on? I didn't do my eyes, I didn't do nothing. Y'all, I'm just trying to see if this stuff work. If it's good and if I got the right shape. I'm just trying to see how good it looks. I'm not going to do my eyebrows or nothing either. I should have got my eyebrows done. That's first and foremost. Um, but yeah, but this was also a last minute decision. I had already put my lashes on and um, yeah, so the lashes was already on. Okay, well, primer's on, let's get to it. Okay, so I got the Maybelline Color Stay 24 hour skin tint. Um, it's in the shade 338. So um, yeah, I really just eyeballed this. Um, I looked at the you know how you swipe on Target and they show like an example of it on whatever skin tone you pick? Yeah. So I kind of just matched it like that, but we know how that goes. I haven't had a precise match since uh, I got matched with Il Maquillage. And so that's what I use mainly is Il Maquillage. Um, if you want to see how that works, you could see my Valentine's Day vlog. I did a whole makeup look with Il Maquillage. So um, yeah, if you're hesitant about buying it, it's good sis. it was an exact match now that the primer's on i will take this little tube this tube like this and um does it pick it up i guess it picks it up and i can't find my freaking beauty blender so i'm finna use a um gonna use one of them little triangle blenders I use little pads I got a bunch of these so I'm not too heartbroken heartbroken that I'm gonna use this pink one but I've already used it uh, before it is buildable coverage so Oh, I need more. I guess I'll just put more. Put more on. Try not to put a lot because you know I want that natural, that natural finish. Let me know if y'all have used skin tint before. I had some, it was by Fenty, but <laughs> I got the wrong shade, so. <sighs> this is my second attempt, second attempt at a skin tint. And um, shoot. Kind of good to me, right? So far, yeah. 
a little more, but I mean, I kind of feel like it's doing its job, I guess. I want to see if it'll work as a concealer, kind of, you know? Or maybe that's the point of skin tint, right? It's supposed to be like concealer, or maybe you can put, maybe you can use both concealer and skin tint. And next time I try this, I'm definitely going to try my brush. It feels lightweight though. That's good. Because I don't really wear makeup, y'all. But that's just because my skin breaks out really bad and so that's another reason why I wanted to try skin tint to see like if it'll be lighter on my skin and maybe my skin won't be so irritated but I mean this looks good right Shoot, it looks good to me. I'm gonna turn off my backlight and see just how good it does look. You know what I'm saying? Because that'll probably tell it. I mean, in light, it looks good, so maybe, maybe in flash, maybe in flash, it's not so bad. Cool light. How are we feeling in cool light? I'm feeling good. I mean, she looks good. She looks good. Warm light. She's a little warm. Um, I never really like this light. Y'all, y'all use this light at all? This how it looks. No light. Um, I mean, I think it's cute. I think it's cute. It is my skin tone for the most part. I think it's good. I wish my eyebrows was done, y'all. And no, I can't really do my eyebrows with makeup, so. Hmm. I'm feeling like it's cute. I'm feeling like it's cute. It's lightweight. Um, It's supposed to have vitamin C in it, so hopefully it's good for my skin, too. Um, It did brighten up my face a little bit, but, um, yeah, I think it's cute. Um, I don't remember how much I paid, but it really wasn't that much. Like, you know, Target, well, Target, drug, well, Target's not really a drugstore, but you know, Target makeup is not that much. Um, I guess depending on what you get, but really, if I just had to think off top, I probably spent $6.99, $6.99, $9.99, somewhere in that bracket, because it, it really wasn't a lot. That's why, like, I just wanted to try it. So um, yeah, but this is it. I wasn't trying to do no whole makeup look. I wanted to see how it looked natural because that's how I'm trying to wear it. Um, yeah, I think she did her job though. She's cute. So yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. Kind of a quick video. I just wanted to try this skin tint because <laughs> I'm going out. Um, and as y'all know, I'm the lay friend, but I was trying to do this in the house because I'm normally in the car. Um, but yeah, so this is the look for today. Um, a little natural, well, you know, whatever. I wish I could do my eyebrows, y'all. But really, um, I'm probably gonna go get them waxed and they'll be fine. And I guess I could just pretend or fill them in or whatever. I don't know, but yeah, that's how I look. I think it's cute you know, giving a little summer and like not too much too because it's gonna be a hot summer. So that's another reason why I was trying to try this tint. So 
all right guys thank you if you made it to the end of the video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and talk to me let's talk on instagram i'm always on there so yeah see you later bye